a coin. Okay? You learned about top before, isn't it? Yes. Top makes something rotate. Okay? Top is actually like a force making a, making something to rotate. Yeah? So here of course we have a coin. Okay? Uh, so um, uh, to find the top on the coin, this is the formula. Okay? Top equal to N I A cross B. Uh, it's a cross product. Okay? It's a cross product. So that's why we also use sine theta. In top product, we use cos theta. It's cross product, we use sine theta. And this theta is angle between? Uh, we need to know, know uh, what cross what. Lah. This is A cross B, isn't it? A cross B. So this theta is angle between? Between what? A and B. Yes, A and B. What is A? Area. What is B? Magnetic field. Okay, magnetic field. But be careful. This area is special. This area is the normal to the area, not the plane. This is actually the normal line. This area is the normal line. Uh, what is it mean by normal? 90 degree. Uh, 90 degree to the plane. So let's say we have a coil like that. Okay, with a magnet right, under the magnetic field. So, uh, coil, uh, let's imagine like this, this uh, calculator. Okay, this calculator, this, we regard this uh, as a rotating coil. This calculator like a rotating coil. And this is the plane, you understand? This is the plane. And if this coil is under the magnetic field, it will experience a torque. And this torque makes it to rotate. You understand? Uh, this is the, uh, you know, this is the axis of rotation And this thing is the plane So now we are looking the coil like, assuming like this calculator from this position uh, you look at Yeah, you look from here Okay, uh, so you rotate like that You understand that? Okay, what is it mean by normal? So this theta actually is measured from where to where? Is it from the plane to the magnetic field? No. No, huh? Is it, is it this, this angle? No. I mean, this is the plane. Huh? This is the plane. And the magnetic field is to the right. So, is the angle theta this one? No. No. It's wrong. Okay? This angle theta is between normal and magnetic field. <coughs> normal. So, where's the normal? Normal is 90 degree to the the area, the plane, uh, this one lah. Okay, so we draw to here, yeah. Uh, so, okay. uh, so it's not this one, but the theta is between the normal. Let's draw the normal. Uh, so we, this is the direction of the area, which is the normal to the plane. The normal to the plane, okay. So theta is angle between the normal with the magnetic field. Ah, this is the theta. Understand? Not this one, huh? Okay? Ah, be careful. You understand? Yes. yes. Ah, between the normal, so theta is between the normal and the magnetic field. That's it. Okay? Now, uh, how to determine the direction of the rotation? Huh? Let's say uh, we already know the uh, direction of magnetic field and we want to know how this coil will rotate. Uh, this one is, you look from here, lah. you look from here, and this coil is under the magnetic field. So how this thing will rotate? Is it rotating this way? Or rotating this way? Okay, uh, so let's look at, oh, I haven't drawn the direction of the current. So, okay. Let's say the current is moving this way, current going here, current here, going here, here. Ah, okay, we look part by part. Yeah, we need to look each part. So the first part, so this one also, we also use right hand rule. Remember? Right hand rule. So, the four fingers, ah, 
The four fingers is the current. The palm is the magnetic field. And the thumb is the magnetic force. Okay? Now, now the first part. The current go up, right? Yes. The current go up. So the current go up. Okay, current go up. Magnetic field is to the right. Uh, so our palm is pointing to the right. You see that? Palm is pointing to the right. So our thumb is to the into the plane. Our thumb is the magnetic force. Ah, uh, so our thumb is into the plane. So I uh, mean this way. Ah, this is our magnetic force. You see that? Ah. How about this way? How about this one? The 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 right hand side, this one. Okay, use your hand, please. Use your hand. Current go down. Current go down. Magnetic field, come on. Magnetic field, which is the pump. The pump. Go where? Go to the right. Yeah? Uh, facing the right. Because it's in north to south. So many few to the right. So our thumb, out of page. That's right, out of page. Uh, so our thumb is out of page. So uh, like this. Uh, this is our magnetic four. You understand that? Yes. So what will happen to the point? Yes. The center is the axis of rotation. So like that. Uh, so this, uh, this, uh, the right hand side will experience a force outward. Here you will push inward. So you come like that. You will rotate like that. You understand? Under the magnetic field, if it has current under the magnetic field, you will rotate like that. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, like that. Okay. Uh, if uh, look at this one, if you look at this one, this one is like uh, uh, the what we what? Um, we look assuming from uh, from which position? Let's say we look from uh, from this side. Okay. If you look from this side. Okay, this is our eye, we look from this side. So we see something like when we, uh, you know, when the uh, coil rotate like that, right? When we see from below here, we see something like this, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, like that. Okay? We look from, we look from below, we see something like that. Okay? Ah. So for this part, for here, this current is going what direction? I mean, here, this one, this part. This one. This one. Uh, current is actually go into the page, isn't it? Yes. Uh, current is going into the page, you see? If you look from here, we see the current is going into the page. So in the page, for this part is current going, uh, current going down is going towards your eye. Towards your eye, so it's going out, right? Uh, see? Uh, so, so uh, use your hand, use your hand. You know how to use your hand? Uh, so current going into the page, right? Current going into the page. Magnetic field is to the right. So force is downward. downward. That's right. The force is downward. Ah, uh, force is downward. Ah, uh, and then how about this one? This one. Current going out. Right. Current going out. So magnetic field is going to the right. So force is upward. Force is upward. Ah, you see? You see that? Yes. So how this thing will rotate? It will rotate. What direction? Ah, you see that? This is the axis of rotation. Yes. So this thing will rotate. Where is the calculator? Ah, this thing will, will rotate anti-clockwise. Yeah? It will rotate anti-clockwise. Uh, so if we look from the body, if we look from the body, is uh, we saw something like this one, kan? Ah, uh, kalau kita tengok di bawah sini, kita nampak anti clockwise sebenarnya. Yeah, we look, uh, we saw something like uh, this one, yeah. The force, right? Understand? Okay. Ah, uh, for this example, I want to ask you. So this one got experience of torque, lah. You know, got torque. Ah, uh, got torque. To find the torque, there is a formula. Now I want to ask you, what is the angle theta for this example? What is the angle theta? This angle theta. What is the angle theta for this example? Ah, so first of all, we must draw what? The 
normal. So the normal is uh, this way. Okay? And this is the direction of the area, which is the normal. So, direction theta is between normal and magnetic field. So, uh, so this is the 90 degree. 90 degree. Okay? So, so find our top. Let's say find our top. Top equal to what? B, I, and A sin 90. Isn't it? Uh, sin 90 equal to 1. So, this is maximum top. Uh, because it multiply one. Uh, when this is, when the the you know when the coil is in this position, it experiences maximum torque. Yeah, it has the maximum torque. Uh, okay. Uh, how to get the minimum torque? Uh, zero degree. Zero. zero degree. How how it looks like? How does it look like? Uh, Can I draw off this one? Yes. Okay. So let's uh, let's see. Yeah. So how is the uh, minimum top? How to get the minimum top? So uh, this way, okay. Uh, how to get the minimum top? Yeah, the plane like that. Understand? Uh, the plane is like that. Yeah, this is the plane. And uh, what is the direction of the area? The normal. Ah, uh, we must draw the normal. Eh? Remember, you must draw the, always draw the normal because theta is between normal and magnetic field. Okay? Not the plane, not the plane. It's between the, so, for this one, what is the angle theta? Zero. Between zero. normal and magnetic field? Zero. They are parallel, right? Yes. So, this one is zero degree. So, what is our top? Zero. B, I, N, A, sign yes. zero. So, sign zero equal to? Sin 0 equal to 1. Sin 90 equal to 1. Sin 0 also equal to 1. Ah. Huh? Sin 0 equal to 0. Uh, cos 0 equal to 1. Cos 0. Huh? If sin 0 equal to 0. So we get 0. Ah, that means here it doesn't experience any torque to make it rotate. So here is minimum torque. Okay? Uh, what's, the, what's the unit for torque again? Remember the unit for torque? Uh, uh, what's the unit for torque again? Torque actually is uh, torque is actually uh, Fs uh, cos, uh, sorry, sin theta, right? Ah, uh, torque is, unit is Newton meter. It has the same unit as the work done. Uh, Newton meter. Yeah? Unit for torque is Newton so how to get maximum torque? When like that, when the, the plane is parallel uh, to the magnetic field, get maximum torque. But when the plane is perpendicular to the magnetic field, you get zero torque. 